I share my God, queens and kings. I share Vanavara Masedi. I share spiritual beings. Welcome back to my channel. Kena gogo mi ahavo. Gogo pia whatever you want to call me. I'm your girl. <laughs> okay, so welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, gyal amurela. Welcome to the family. So, um, as you can see by the title of the video, I'm going to be doing dream interpretation part two. There's part one somewhere in the video. So, if you are a dreamer, go check that video out and try to see or maybe there's one dream that you have been asking yourself about i might have interpreted that dream so i'm going to be doing more of those dream interpretation videos because a lot of people are asking me that it dreams so i have a book with me don't mind me looking down because i wrote the dreams down and i'm going to be jumping into them so let me just jump into the video straight into the video because i know at the time when i decide to start interpreting the toro the dreams i'm gonna be talking a lot non-stop i'm gonna be adding and doing all those things again so the first dream um dreaming driving a car or dreaming driving your dream car so first of all realize that when you dream of yourself driving a car or driving your dream car it literally means it means you are taking control over your life sometimes you might find or you dream of yourself driving a car and then um you're with someone in that car you know that means worry yeah still you're in control of your life you might find worry you are dreaming someone driving your dream car that means or someone is in control of your life so you need to connect and communicate with your ancestors so if you have this thing of dreaming driving a car just know or you are taking control of your life okay if you dream of yourself driving a car it's am in backwards just know worry hey, there's something wrong but then if you dream of yourself driving a car and then it's moving forward, that's just no worrying. You are taking control of your life. Whatever you're doing, keep doing it. If you're connecting, praying, doing whatever you have to do, cleansing and all those stuff, continue doing those things because you are in control of your life and do not allow anyone to drive your car or drive your dream car. Again, the second dream, um, dreaming about animal sitting with you like lions, you know, when you're around lions or sleeping next to a lion or one to the become aware that um we also possess certain um animal spirits within our dna become aware worry we are connected to everything we do have ancestors that come in the form of animals because they are trying to show you worry you have um this type of thing you know it's a sign also worrying you might have certain psychic abilities within you it's a sign or you do have psychic abilities within you because remember you are a spiritual being so if you dream being around animals just know or those are your spiritual animal the spiritual animals which you possess within yourself spiritual animals that come to you as protectors as they are trying to show you we are also connected to your ancestors we are the ones who were roaming around with your ancestors in the spiritual realm but when it's very important for you to become aware of it. Sometimes when you dream about animals in your dreams, it doesn't necessarily mean worry. people are trying to attack you. No, there are those that, yes, come in evil um, ways to do certain things to you. But then there are those that come to you because they want to protect you. Come to you because they're trying to show you that you are a spiritual being. Come to you because they're trying to show you that you have a spiritual calling. Come to you because they're trying to show you or mana you are going through a spiritual awakening. So become aware or if you like being around lions, uh, uh, you know, elephants, all those animals that um you might see on different types of cloth. Remember or those are representing your ancestors. Those are representing um the certain spirit, animal spirits which guide you and which protect you and which um are connected to you. Do not be afraid. It's very important for you to pay attention to this type of things in your dreams stop being afraid in your dreams okay so the other the next dream is dreaming of strings um what are, what do i mean when i'm talking about strings i'm talking about you see um this type of strings strings which um prophetic people wear on their on their hands um this different color strings when you're big when you're being given that string i get go and buy it and then wear it you can also pass her and ask your ancestors, or what do you want me to do with this type of string? There's a meaning behind why you're supposed to be wearing that type of string. Remember, this string represents a prophetic gift. Like there's also another sec more sacred things that are going on behind the strings. But if you dream of being given a string, tap, tap, go and buy it 
we passage o bo je bo kolo bra kholo re bo kolo bra kholo ke re ke le thapo e rashi yo le re ke dieng ka yo agar they gonna tell you in your dreams they gonna show you what you need to do in your dreams for those who know some of them even wear them on their hands legs and all those things because they are representing um their prophetic side they are representing their <coughs> prophetic gift so it's very important or when you are dreaming of being given or holding or you know seeing a string become aware or it's yours it belongs to you it's one of your prophetic gift ashi so the next one is um what is the next dream dreaming seeing someone who's still alive but being buried okay if you have this tendency of dreaming of people who are still alive being buried just no worry obona lo jabat you are seeing lo jabat okay Rem, uh, also it means worry this person they are burying this person while they are still alive you don't necessarily have to die um for you to be you know um bitarin for you to become used or to become a puppet or what there are people who have been buried while they are still alive there are people who um are not even here but then physically their appearance yeah physically they are here but then spiritually they're not here so if you have this thing of dreaming people being buried while they are alive just know worrying your ancestors are trying to show you or there's something being done to this person and this person is about to leave us you know this person is being buried while he's still alive his spirit is being buried while the physical body is still alive you might find the word they are trying to switch that person's spirit and give him a certain spirit and then after doing that what happens his spirit goes to the spiritual realm and then it's being used for certain things so it's very important for you to pray if um you see this type of dream for you to pray for that particular person or hey nobody's going to touch this person we are here to help each other so the moment you see somebody being buried while they are still alive just know what it's a sign from your ancestors trying to show you or when this person that trying to kill bury his spirit before the actual time you know so it's important for you to pray for that person okay so the next dream dreaming being lost being in the dark so if you dream of yourself being lost just know or it's your soul your spirit trying to show you or you need to find yourself seeing yourself in the dark it means or it's a magali susuin you need to connect you need to come back to yourself you need to find yourself you need to connect and to communicate with your ancestors so that you can find yourself but i'm actually it's it's not a it's not a good thing because what i'm actually saying you don't see anything but then the moment you connect with your ancestors they shed light with you they share light with you and they show you what's going on the moment you try to find yourself that is when light comes to you know comes to into that darkness and then get balance we didn't come here to work in the dark but then we came here to to be balanced to work to see both the dark and see both the light you know it's very important or if you see yourself all lost and then all walk in the dark you need to find yourself you need to connect with your ancestors you need to communicate and con- bo ground yourself heal yourself that is the only way for you to be able to what to find yourself and get out of that darkness please okay so so the next question dreaming of dirty water dreaming of dirty water ke machila and machila a revolve around bad luck and the bad luck revolve around the party the party ke bad luck it revolve around um bad things happening to you so if you have this thing of dreaming of dirty water cleanse yourself you know communicate with your ancestors use cloth salt to cleanse yourself because you might find or your ancestors are trying to show you or you are surrounded by a lot of bad luck someone is sending you negative energy so you need to protect yourself protect your energy it's not good to dream about dead water and like you sure the time um you dream about that dead water and and start to cleanse yourself then the water will be pure you know so be very careful with those type of dreams okay so dreaming of bathing with egg somebody asked me this question so i want to it is so interesting or um when you dream bathing gamai eggs it means or you need cleansing you need to cleanse yourself cleanse yourself the very same way you saw um yourself being cleansed in the dream use eggs to cleanse yourself you know sometimes the, the dreams the revoncha 
things that we need to do they even show you that what you need to use but then people tend to keep on asking what do i need to what does it mean it means exactly what you see in your dreams it means you can ask your ancestors do your research we have google for a reason as much as yes sometimes google lies but then you are also allowed to use it especially when you are searching doing research you know say things that are going to help you and guide you and grow you spiritually so pay attention to your dreams your dreams have everything that you need they have answers that you're seeking dreaming your teeth falling out if you have this thing your teeth falling out it means stop talking too much stop sharing if you talk too much, stop talking too much. If you share too much, stop sharing too much. That is why you dream your teeth falling out. Okay, so um, this is all of the dreams that I have today. It's not too much. I didn't touch too much on them because I, I felt like these ones are not that too much. I guess. So yeah, pay attention to your dreams, connect with your dreams and connect with your ancestors ground yourself love yourself protect yourself it's all about you it's all about you it's all about you protecting yourself and then everything will gravitate towards you because now you're focusing on yourself Ashe.